Oh yeah, don't print flames here. Where's Don't be dogs. There you go, you can see it now. Right. In this video, we're gonna be doing my updated fishing kit. It's a lot bigger than my last one. Um let me just move that out of the way, where that's on the sofa. <laughs> um so yeah, it's a lot bigger than my other one. Um I'm still working on it. There's things I'm still tweaking. I'm still trying to work out if I don't really need it. If I don't need it, I'll get rid of it. And I guess all of this fits in the bottom of my rucksack. Right, give me a second, guys. I'll grab my rucksack quickly. Right, this is my rucksack. All of this fits in this bottom compartment here with my hunting stuff, with my hunting equipment. Um, so, yeah. As I said, this is my rucksack. This is the new one. The one I've been working on. I have to believe I've changed most of this myself, so I'll go that'll be another video coming up soon. So that's the rucksack, that's where it goes. Now I'll show you the fishing stuff. I do have some of this fishing line. I am gonna be asking which one would you recommend because this stuff I don't truly get along with. It's 0.25 mil, so it's a quarter of a millimeter thick. I don't know the. Oh, it's a six pound line. And so, yeah, that's the one I'm using at the moment. It's not on my. It's not on my um wheel at the moment. I'm just updating that soon. But if you can recommend a better one, please do. So my fishing line. We'll go for the, we'll do the thing. Same pen rod. As you can see, same pen rod. I've got two of these, so, yeah. But the new thing is, from the rod, is a new fishing reel. And this is it. Oh, that's supposed to be out there. Oops. <laughs> see, new fishing rod. Wheel. It's a pen rod fishing reel. Looks like I've got to go and buy a new one because this one's got a massive hole in it now for some stupid reason. How the hell did I get that? How the hell did I get a hole there? Sorry guys, I'm just really confused right now. I've got a massive hole in my fishing reel. So, I might have to go back to the old one. Well, I'll check it out, but we might, I might have to go back to the old one. This is something different. You might have seen this tub before because I do have in my cook kit, and I have one here in my fishing kit, and I have one in my first aid kit, and I have another one somewhere else. Right, we'll go on this side first. I have beads in two different size weights. This side I have. Um, um, glow stick, fishing glow stick. I have swivels plus they apparently float the line. Apparently, I've never used them before, so I'm going to give it a go. And I have some fishing lures. These fishing lures, I don't know if I'm going to keep in here, I don't know if I'm going to keep them in the kit. So, let's have there. Things in for fishing gloves or hunting gloves or whatever you want to call them. Um, hook kit's new enough to tackle the same thing. The only difference is, as you can see, there's the hooks. The only difference is these two containers. One's got the bait hooks in now. One's got these are barb barbed hooks. These are barbless. So that's the only difference. They are good. It is a good piece of kit. It's still the magnetic, and they're on magnetic strip, magnetic tape. So as you can see. It's actually quite strong magnetic tape. I do have a piece of magnetic tape at the back because my my thing will be when I need when I'm setting up and I'm getting a hook out, I put it on there and then I'm automatically knowing where it is. I'm not going to lose it. So that's what I'm doing that. Um, still, still the same bait box. The only difference is I took the um foam pieces out and everything like this. There you can see. 
you can see I've still got these really stupid, really nice small fishing lures. Same ones as last time. These are all new. So these are all ideal for my area. I was doing research on them. I haven't tried these out yet, these ones, because I think they I've just not been 100 percent I have got some more fishing lures here. I got a mouse lure, a different one. And I got a new spinner. Or spoon, I don't know what they want to, I don't know what they call them. Yeah, this one here is apparently ideal for bass. So I'm going to give that one a go. Hopefully soon. When this because we did have a massive heat wave and now it's absolutely pouring down the way. So yeah. In here I've got loads of fake different type of types of fake bait. I'll open it up for you so you can see it. Oops, I don't want anything to fall out on my computer. So there's my fake bait. In this pencil case it's all my smalls. Like floats. Um in here I have Fishing rod oil or fishing rod oil, a little lubrication, whatever you want to call it. I have a bait, um, bait drill and hook. I have a hook remover. I have the fishing pliers still in here. I still carry some, um, I don't like what leaders, fishing leaders in here. Oh yeah, this is the other difference. This is a big difference. I don't. I like to just have to carry just the one. Now I carry four different sizes of fishing net needles. I have a number eight, a number six, a number four, and a number two. I know how to use these. I recommend them, and I recommend different sizes because at the end of the day, you don't. You, if you need to make an, if you need a net. Yeah, and you don't know what size you need a different size net needle for different size to make a different size nets. Like a number two cannot make a size net of a size of a net from a number eight. Those two make way different sizes. So that's what I recommend. I am doing a video soon, hopefully, on how I make a fishing net. And I'm gonna do it from scratch. I'm not gonna do it, I'm not gonna buy one and fix it. I'm gonna make one from scratch. So that's all what's in there. That's all what's in this little kit. That's all my and I'm I'm not hundred percent sure if I'm still gonna be carrying this yet. But I have got a new net oh not net, what am I saying net for? A new um it's something for the um what do you call it hooks to sit on. I don't know if I'm gonna be taking this yet, I don't know. I ain't decided, but if I do, I do. If I don't, I don't. I'm not fast. So that's open. So I took a long side took over eight minutes. It's going to take nine minutes of time to say goodbye. Tell me what you think. Tell me if you would add things or if you would take something away. And please let me know about the um, fishing line because I am, as I said, I'm not good at things like that. I've researched in my head just pumping. So please tell me what you think. Please like, please share, please subscribe, and please see you in the next one, guys. And um, enjoy the rest of your day. Thanks, guys. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.